We're going to start off with TCU coach Gary Patterson. Let me write my times down here. Gary Patterson discussed NIL today. And I'm sure that this is about some of the great players that are going on that are currently enrolled at TCU. Zach Evans, a five-star running back that has really shown out. Now, he's hadn't played the majority of the time there. But, uh, but yeah, he is an unbelievable athlete. Absolutely incredible. This is what TCU head football coach Gary Patterson said. And he's, he's straight up, this is per Matt Brown, right? And it comes from the Star-Telegram newspaper. He said he's straight up giving the most explicit, please give my recruits money NIL pitch that I've seen so far. The quote in the paper says, in taxes, do you do short form or do you do deductions? I can promise you there's nobody in this room that does the short form, Patterson said, smiling. That's what I'm talking about in recruiting. Everybody lives in the gray area. Everybody in this room lives in the gray area. The bottom line to it is we're going to have to live in the gray area if we want to keep up. There's five SEC schools calling him and telling him, here's what we'll give you if you come here and not stay at TCU, Patterson said. At the end of the day, that's just real life. If we don't do anything about it, within a year, we lose him. The rules have changed. There is no wrong anymore. He said, we planted the trees, now we have to water them. I hear, well, I don't want to get dirty. It feels dirty. I don't know the rules. Let me just say, you guys know me. I'm just going to tell the truth. The bottom line to it is I can lose 25 to 30 guys on scholarships by January. Players recruit players. When a kid calls, well, how are they taking care of you? If they don't say they're giving me this, then the kid is not going to come. Players recruit players. It takes more to stay where we're at than it took to get here. We've done a lot to get here, but if you want to play at a very high level, what you have to understand is we're going to have to do some things to make sure that we stay and keep growing. At the end of the day, what does that entail? We're going to have to learn, but we're going to learn a lot faster than what everybody right now is willing to do. He is not wrong. The SEC knows that there is no real, there's no real rule. You can pay players now. And if you're at TCU, you got donors, you got guys, you got businesses that can give money to these players. And it doesn't matter if it feels wrong. If you've been playing clean the whole time and you've had the same success that Patterson's had, that good on you, but it's not going to continue. Because now that he is actually getting recruiting wins, remember, this is the most talented roster that TCU has had since Patterson's been there. I mean, we're talking over two decades. And he's now getting the best roster that they've ever had. You're going to have to do something to make sure that those guys continue to come to the school. I think this is exactly what Matt Brown said from the Extra Points newsletter. He is telling you, you have got to pay these kids. Period. End of story because they're going to go elsewhere. They will get deals somewhere else if you don't pay them at TCU. And and I think that they will get that taken care of. I mean, with this being as public as it has been, it's become such a massive story for Gary Patterson because he doesn't do this. He is the the super clean guy. I expect this to pick up big time. Look for some big time NIL deals coming out of Dallas Fort Worth very very soon because they are going to have to do that to keep up with the Joneses. And with Oklahoma and Texas leaving, TCU has got a real shot to be the breadwinner in that conference. Even with the smallest the school is, you can become a massive, massive brand by winning championships in that conference. you got to be on the ball right now. Got to be on the ball right now. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.